have here today is a mechanical seal that you'll typically find in one of our pumps. You have a stationary seat that will be inside the back plate. You have a rotating assembly that will be on the shaft itself, uh, sometimes referred to as the bellows, and then you have your spring. Uh, some models will have a spring retainer, some don't. Uh, whatever your seal comes with should be what's required for the replacement. Things that you may need to do the seal, uh, some gloves and some lubricant. The key thing you want to focus on when you're replacing the seal is make sure you keep everything clean. Uh, particularly the faces on the seal. These are lapped very, very flat. Any kind of grease or fingerprints or debris will cause your seal to fail and cause a leak. Uh, on this stationary face, you'll see the shiny side, which has been lapped. You have a dull side, which usually has a notch in it. The notch is not used in most pump models. And then you have your O-ring for sealing this in the back plate. The rotating assembly has a few more pieces to it. You have your mating face, you have the outer piece, and then you have the rubber bellows inside. Using a PVC pipe actually works pretty well for installing the hard seat into the back plate. Uh, it's very important, just like with everything else in the seal, you want to make sure that the end of the pipe is flat and clean. If you have to really push on it, something is wrong, back up, take a second, and check for burrs, make sure that you're pushing on the seal straight. Make sure that you size the pipe to the seal that you're using.